Laser scanning can be used for accurate deformation monitoring. In order to determine the deformation of the tank shell, each individual point is assigned a value using its distance from the centre of the tank, its point radius. The data can be unfurled and laid flat. The plot of deviations allows us to easily visualise out of roundness. Areas coloured yellow show outward deviations and areas coloured blue show inward deviations. In this image, the deformation colour range has been altered such that the unfurled surface is coloured green where the tank shell is not bowed outward or inward by more than plus or minus 5 cm. This makes the larger deformations more visible and we can clearly see that when the tank is full the amount of inward deformation, coloured blue, is reduced and the amount of outward deformation, coloured yellow, is increased. Radial displacement plots slices through the storage tank, can be created at any location. The plots here show a measurement for every degree around the tank wall at the three different states of fill. We can exaggerate the small differences to better help visualise the deviations. In this case, the largest deviations are approximately 7cm from the ideal tank shell. These graphs show the variation in verticality throughout the tank wall's height. We create a section from 0 to 180 degrees and also at 90 to 270 degrees. This allows us to report the vertical angle north-south and east-west. Laser scanning allows us to use the millions of points surveyed on the tank wall, which we can best fit a cylinder through. The axis of the cylinder indicates the overall tank verticality. From the scan data, we can analyse the tilt of the storage tank at different states of fill and monitor both the tank and its foundations to quantify changes that may be caused by settlement or subsidence. Whilst the probability of a catastrophic failure of the storage tank is low, such incidents do occur. Failure can be the result of a damaged pipe or valve connection or even partial removal of a small section of tank wall. Failures such as the one depicted here tend to be sudden events. 3D model can provide information about the complexity of the terrain and therefore allow for the mapping of the path and speed of the oil spill. We can scan tanks of any size, material or shape, inside and outside, above ground and below ground. 